My name is John. Gaming it has ruined my life. I'm 31 years old. <laughs> M G T O W. But men going their own way. MGTOW. It's showtime. To a new frontier and beyond. This is Sparta! Yeah, no one believes me, but I would sell anyways. <sighs> this is, you know who it is, I'm pissed off too. Whew! Man. I found out my dad leased my brand new freaking bike that I found on streets. And no one wound, not even locked up. I even double checked the wound, like, what the fuck? How could someone, anyone, just leave this bike here, like this, in the middle of freaking nowhere like that, basically, not locked up or anything, not even well hidden, hidden, I mean, you would think that it would be hidden, at least. But freaking wide open area, no cameras around, now if I could see, it's like, what the, what, who would do that? But nonetheless, no matter what excuse of me obtaining that brand new bike, and it light flame by the way, it really looks good and felt good, but I could have felt better if I could actually ride it a little, maybe a couple days. Oh wait, I couldn't even ride it for like an hour. I, what I did, I grabbed it. Oh, sir, I looked around, and I even uh, went in a circle, I think I did, please, sir. And I went down the street, headed toward my dad's house eventually. Uh, of course, I didn't load it, I had a uh, bike. But anyways, oh yeah, and when I uh, was at a parking lot, apparently a private parking lot, uh -huh, no trespassing, whatever, vehicles that started coming out of nowhere at that time, anyways... Uh, yeah, when a guy said, ask, are those you two bikes? Like, of course he asked that. I wonder freaking why he asked that. Of course, it's a freaking train. Uh, all the time I've been here for the like, uh, past uh, months on and off, I must have missed its train went by so many times during this time period. Regardless, though, the noise in the background, the squeaking, squeezing noise that's trying to cover up what going on with us humans the crimes against humanity uh -huh. um but yeah yeah eventually I got to my dad's the bike and I let it be there and I did check up on it but I didn't load it I, I could any time any time mess up that brand new paint job with my chain lock and uh, put my seat on it and white it but, you know, I just didn't go around to it yet. It was destined to take place. However, then I find out all of a sudden my dad leads out to someone because his bike ain't working. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. What drugs did he offer him, I wonder? What rights do this not human has over my life because there are only 100 million humans. It's unlikely that he's human. So now my bike is in a limbo right now, my other bike. But do I need it? Uh, I was going to check up on it, and maybe I would have automatically been like, you know, I, I'm going to test drive it, uh, you know, down the street. Who knows? Who knows what I would have done? But now I want to even more so, but, you know, yet some not human can ride my bike, my second bike, can ride my bike, but yet I ain't allowed to ride my second spare bike, and who knows if it's gone. Who knows if it's missing or not. Taking my transportation. I hope not. I hope not. There's no trading behind the scenes or, you know, metaphor trade or whatever. Like, oh, you know, thanks for the bike. You know, you, you can have my bike. It's not working properly, Scotty. But, you know, hey, you know, here you go. Like, forget you. You know, it could be any, any which way about it. It could be any which way about it. You know it. I know it. We all know it. And it's just a matrix and it, the devilish demons 
And of course, ETs, extraterrestrials, universals, not the galactics. I for surely think the galactics would have helped me out by now. But no, they don't. Because the universal is bullying them and dismissing. And they're trying to take my DNA, the universals are. Everyone taking my DNA. I mean, it's, uh, proving this time and time again, and I can't wait till after everything everything is said and done, and uh, I find out either one or two things that all my video content is gone all of a sudden in 4D, or all my video content is there. Maybe even all my last channel content as well. Now I, I can already find out though that hey. I can log into my other account that was supposed to be deleted throughout history, right? Uh, we'll find out. Because freaking apparently, the treachery dime a dozen nowadays. All my wife's being taken away from me, stripped by bit by bit. And I just had an angry witch. Just, just, just. Oh, got freaking pissed. And I'll build a video to you right now. Get off the property! You almost hit me. I did not. That, that, that's the, the second time you. The Get second time you went property. boom. That's the second time Get you off went boom. The property. The second time you went Get boom. Off the property. You went boom. You are trespassing. You went boom. You didn't go slow. You didn't go slow. You went boom. And you look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Even at an angle, we went boom. I was like, whoa. I went what? Whoa. It's like, whoa. What's your problem with speeding? And she got all pissed off and said motherfucker and stuff like that. And I'm not a motherfucker. I never fuck a mother. I would never fuck a mother. She crazy. That two times, that two times and two nights, separate nights, that she did that. She went all of a sudden, whoom. Whoom. Hey, I, hey, I, I'm staying. I'm staying. I'm staying. I'm staying. Great. I hey, great. Hey, I got it. I got it here. I got it all on camera. Yep. How, how you like that? How how you like those apples? Yep. Cool and mean, but yeah, you should have heard her say those things specifically. All everything you should have heard. Everything you should have even heard that vehicle going, you know, almost like it hitting me. Jeez, I'm trespassing. How am I trespassing? I, I, oh, but it's always something. And she did it before, too. It was another time she almost sideswipes me. She don't care. She don't care. She, she hell blazing. She hell blazing in life. And even if she is human, even if she is human, which I highly doubt it. I highly, highly doubt it. But even if she is, even if she is, she is clearly, clearly causing problems. She is set up to cause me problems. To say I'm somehow trespassing, I'm just using a Wi-Fi. That's all I'm doing. I was even standing this time. Luckily, who knows? Who knows what would happen? There's no excuse for whamming or even a nil hit. And I'd be curious how close it would was for me to get this twiggled, but I'm so sleepy because I not getting enough sleep and that's because I'm freaking homeless. But yeah, I see the treachery a dime a dozen nonetheless. Apparently I and Troy Pats, apparently I got no whites, a government building, and she has whites to now we have a job. To try to warm me over almost, or try to make it close as possible to make it reasonable that I shouldn't even be there or whatever. Like, who knows? Who knows how far it goes? But they mine won't get wet any, any more than my mind. Because when I when I said something before, I swear to God my mind would be in wed all of a sudden. Like I I I know things that you all don't want me uh, me to know. Uh, or and I, you know, 
made it seem like someone told me something one way or other. Because, and, you know, it doesn't matter anyway. It's because they know now that, because I felt like my mind was being probed all of a sudden. Because they were curious. So what the fuck are they doing taking my DNA, guarding me like that, and making sure that I don't get any help that I deserve? If karma don't, if Drake Bailey says and proves karma don't exist, he said he he said it himself, karma don't exist. Then what the fuck am I doing from this in this life? Because apparently I did nothing wrong. I did absolutely nothing wrong to deserve all this in this life. But what about the last life? Maybe I deserve something from the last life. But then again, it's like. I still, you know, if you're on that, like, because the amount of control going on at play, it's sickening. But however, however, though, like, if he even says that and it actually is true, then I shouldn't be punished anyways for anything past life related. Because I always forgot everything. If Is that not good enough? Is me not being able to remember anything? Ain't that good enough punishment? So why am I doing not only getting mind weight, DNA weight, and situational weight, and pillaged, and pillaged, thanks, but pillaged, and my bike pillaged upon, it doesn't matter if it actually is stolen or not, or that it would be brought to me, back to me, it's the fact though that I couldn't even have my own memories on it Precisely. That, that, that was a great find. It's like some witch guy or chick just like put the bike there for the homeless to have to have at it. The future would know. The future would know the treachery that took place. Just try to delete it all. I swear to God, the Matrix don't want me to say all this. But, yeah, the implications that took place. If there anything that ill took place. I swear to God. Like, there could be a couple implications. Like, oh, the staff makes sure they watch out for me and they just, they just call cops immediately. Right? For nothing. You know, it doesn't matter if I got evidence or not. You know? There could be something like that took place, but I don't want any possibilities like that to take place because I don't like to get thrown out of society more so than I already did or have because I'm a human straight white man and my DNA being taken daily, nightly, every freaking day, constantly. I know the value I possess and I know I'm hated, but I loved, I'm cherished, my DNA is, but not myself, my who I am it's what I am yeah you know what I'm saying it's sickening but yeah yeah it ain't this that situation uh, another situation that I'm getting uh, talked down to by indirectly by the demons that are healing it's like what the fuck like what the fuck who, who are they to criticize me and then also criticize the cashier like Apparently, they criticized the cashier or some shit for criticizing me. Like, who cares what you think? It's it's insane. Like, why would anyone care what you think anyways? But I guess a lot of individuals care to think this or that anyways, and they love mocking me. They ain't falling apart enough, it seems. I see them. I see the no life in their eyes. Or the craziness in their eyes. I, I see it all the time. Regardless though. I was. Uh, apparently not having my car. Able to be worked. Or it did go through the first time. But it couldn't go through a second time. I don't understand that. Uh, I'll definitely check that out. And I'll give an update. On the end of this clip. If there was something problematic about it. But apparently my EBT card. Didn't work. I just want to get me a pole pulp and some snack, uh, like two for two dollar type of snack. Like, oh, Como chocolate, you know, 
whatever that works that sogo uh i'm gonna need sogo in the morning so pretty cheap i can't tell if my card worked or not and if it did someone else still paid for it yeah someone still paid for it and i noticed there was something cookie with him too but whatever it's like everywhere i look is like ugh. and because i was in line like I was and having the implications that taking place I suppose he would just like I you know take out of this I thanked him you know enough clearly <laughs> and been on my way and it's like if it ain't one thing it's a freaking other you know what I mean and that's always going to be the case until something is forcefully changed like me getting off the streets and I cannot believe that all these humans that supposedly would have money doesn't even care damn about looking anyone up that speaks about they are human. I'm going to make sure that this title speaks that I'm human and if someone still don't care damn then I, I suppose that they ain't from the future A or B they don't know what's going on or C that they are. They don't probably don't even know if they're human or not human, or, or specifically, they probably don't even know that any non-humans are walking among them. They probably don't even know that there are non-humans walking among them. There, like I mean, so whatever the implications are, it's like it's sickening to actually comprehend that this shit so is going on and that I'm getting defunded left and right, and situations are just taking place left and right that causing me. And apparently Universal's problems. Like I'm supposed to have like magical powers by now, right? I'm not even healed. <laughs> Nothing about me is taking place positively. So I'm just in limbo and I'm just like listening to the Kit Dunn and Drake Bailey and just like they spewing that nonsense that positive nonsense because it doesn't take place. Nothing takes place. Now I listen to Donald Trump and it's like, what the fuck? Say something worth it. But he's saying third D type stuff. He, that's all he's doing. Saying third D type stuff. Now I'm supposed to vote for the guy? No. He said he promised me. He promised me that I'm gonna win so much that I get sick and tired of winning. And I ain't voting for someone who is a freaking fraud. Who lied to me. Sir, I didn't vote for him because I didn't vote for anyone. I don't even think I was registered. If I was, whatever. Maybe I was just too lazy. Didn't care. Blah blah. blah. Because why wouldn't I not care? But now, now, since I do got the chance to vote for the guy, that I literally ain't registered, I made sure at least, for the past four years, I suffered so much by the not humans and by the system that I just got sick and tired of losing. I got sick and tired of losing. So, why would I vote for the guy, huh? There are a couple of things that took place. It's just like, what? It's going to happen again? Or next week? Huh? <laughs> it's going to happen. Something's going to happen. And it's not going to be positive, not for sure. Not unless it's forced. It's sickening. It's sickening.